do want to be the most electrifying man on YouTube Entertainment. It is Friday and I'm hanging out here at the house all by myself. And well, you guys know what that means. When I'm by myself, I get loud. And when I get loud, I start to rant. So you guys are lucky today is Friday. Let's get to moving on a new rant. And well, you know, I thought about a lot of things that I was going to scream about this week that were pissing me off. But... I think I narrowed it down to one thing very specific that irritated the shit out of me when I heard about it. Normally, I talk about wrestling and things that you know upset me in WWE or don't make sense and whatnot. But I'm going to make a left turn. That's right. Right to the left side. Because today, we're going to talk about candy. And you're like, do you have candy? And I'm like, yeah. Candy! And you're like, well, pop the brakes! Woo, woo, woo! And I'm like, well, why? You're like, well, you know, Snickers and, and, and Skittles and, and Kit Kats and Reese's and Milky Ways and Starburst. All those delicious candies? And I'm like, oh, no, 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 no. Let me tell you what I'm talking about, guys. <clears throat> I came across this article, and I heard it on the radio, that there's a certain candy company... That after being in business since 1847, that's a long fucking time. After being in business since 1847, they're on their last legs and much like Toys R Us, they're going out of business. And you're like, whoa, do I have holy shit, I didn't hear about that. And I'm like, I did. What candy company are we talking about, do up? Well, we're talking about... The Necco Wafers! Yeah, no. That's right. This company announced that they're about to go out of business. Oh, God damn it! Okay, give me a second. I gotta let the dog in. Well, Roscoe Dog has now joined us. He's come inside from taking a big doggy dump. Back to what we were talking about. Whoa, dog. Break it down, man. Listen now. So, the Necco Wafer Candy Company has... Going out of business if they don't find a buyer or a, you know, a investor. Well, face the facts. You're done. You want to know why? Because your candy's fucking terrible. This is the worst candy on the planet. I mean, these little uh, circle flavored chalk discs do not even taste like the flavor fruit they're supposed to. Okay? Nobody should give a shit. But I'm irritated because people are pissed. They've lost their minds. And as soon as they announced that they're going out of business, the Necco wafer sales increased by 63%. Who's eating this shit? It's terrible. I mean, I hate it. You guys make up your own damn minds, but I, I think it's fucking disgusting. Now, with that being said, this same candy company produces... Other great gems that you guys also might enjoy. That's right. Have you guys ever eaten a Mary Jane? Yeah, these things are terrible. We used to, as soon as we got them, we used to throw them right in the garbage because the only time you'd ever get them is when some cheap bastard down the road picked up a bag of 500 of them for like three bucks and gave it to you while you were trick or treating. You'd never go to the store and say, hmm. I'm in the hankering for something sweet. Oh, you know what? Mary Jane. Not a chance, because it's awful. Okay? Now, the same candy company also produces those little candy hearts that you get at Valentine's Day with the little message on it. Nobody ever eats these things. They're like decoration. They're not really even candy. They're so terrible. They, you, I wish I could tell you they taste like a sweet tart, but they don't. They taste like eating dried Tylenol. Okay? We used to use them as ammunition at class and throw them at each other's heads as soon as the teacher wasn't looking. I don't advocate that. Don't do it. And then say, do up, said to do it, because I told you not to do it. We used to take a handful of them and chuck them at each other and get pelted with the spread of these hard, terrible, hard candies, okay? Now, this same candy company also produces the Charleston Chew. These things were specifically designed to break your teeth. Well, I don't know if that's exactly true. If you want to keep your teeth, I'd steer clear of the Charleston Chew. Unbelievable. So I heard all this news and I heard people lost their minds. They were pissed off and going crazy because they're going out of business. And guys, I just, I tried. I tried to put the pieces in order and I just can't figure out why anybody would care. I, it is now 
probably, like I said, the worst candy available. If you found somebody that enjoyed a Mary Jane, it's probably because they're 98 years old and that was the only candy available to them back in 1910 when they was just a little one. That was far before the Hershey's deliciousness and the Kit Kats and Reese's and Snickers and Starburst and Skittles and all the delicious candy. That's actually good that you'd willingly pay money for. So guys, I don't know what else to say. I think it's fucking ridiculous that people are pissed these people are going out of business. I feel bad for them. I really do. But maybe better candy next time. That's just my personal opinion. Uh, probably going to get heat for it. I don't know. But you guys can tell me all about it. What do you think? Leave it in the comments below. Let me know what you think because I ain't going to know unless you leave it down below why are people pissed about this do you guys enjoy necco wafers do you eat those things i don't do you have the mary janes and and the valentine hearts and the charlton did you eat this shit let me know put it in the comments but as for now rest my dog give me your dog there's butt there he is good boy for now, see my watch? I'm out of time, man. I gotta get to moving. So, like the video. Leave those comments. Let me know what you think. And if you haven't done it already, subscribe for some more too, huh? Hey, Doug, eat it. Yeah. Oh, do you guys want to go get Enzo with me? I gotta go get him from the babysitters. You want to take a ride? All right, come on. Let's get to moving. Well, here we are. Let's go inside and get that little bugger. Yeah. He's doing quite a great show there with his reflection. Brum, brum, brum. Brum, brum, brum. Come on, we gotta go bye bye. Let's go. No, come on. Yeah. yeah, I know. He just wants to run around. Let's get to moving, child. Come on, Chamaco. Oh, all right there, bro, Tato Chip. Are you ready to let it rip? Huh? We're headed home. Did you need to stop at the store and buy any Neko wafers or Mary Janes? I didn't think you did. Nobody does. All right. I'm done. I'm sorry. Come on, man. Let's get home. We'll go and we'll play with our dog. It's so nice outside. Maybe we'll run around the backyard. What do you say? Keep the brakes on the moon. Well, we're home. Let's go play. Yeah. Come on, dude. You want to go outside? Don't you want to go outside and play? What are you doing over there with the speaking spell? Huh? All right. Here we go. Whoa. Holy smokes. There he goes. Straight down the ramp. Dude, you're savage. Don't get hurt. Here comes Doug. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got to get me. You're not going to get me. Whoa, look out, Doug. Whoa. Wait. Whoa. Careful, pup. What's the matter? What, you want one of your toys? You want one of those things? Check it out, guys. I got some bubbles. <laughs> Playing bubbles. Go ahead. Dip it in. There you go. And give it a square. You go. Soap everywhere. You're doing a great job, bro. Are you having fun playing bubbles? The dog's having fun. Here you go. Oh, 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 down, down. There you go, good job. Get it again, whoa, bubbles. Yay! Yay! Solid steel bubbles. I'm down, down, down. Oh, jeez Louise, you're getting a bath tonight. Well, you're already covered in soap yeah. now. Oh, That's about all the time that we're gonna have today for playing outside in the yard. I mean, well. You know, he's still playing around outside in the yard, but that's about all the time we're going to have today. We got to get to moving, man. My watch definitely says we're out of time now. We got to get to moving. So let us know what you think about Enzo playing in the yard. And guys, the Neko wafers, leave those comments if you haven't done it so already. But like I said, we're out of here. Dude, put that down, man. Don't, don't play with that. All right, I got, I, I got my hands full. I got to go, guys. Like the video, leave those comments if you haven't done it already. Subscribe for some more do up Enzo and the dog. Where is he at? He's around somewhere. Crazy. Oh, wait, there he is. Dick. Watch out, Potato Chip. The dog is ready. I got that frisbee. <laughs> Are you ready, dog? Are you ready, dog? Uh, Chuck, get a pup. Yeah, get it, Doug. Ooh, almost took a header right into the tree. All right, come on, let's go inside now.